Because Israel are the Rosh of the Partsuf and the rest are the Guf, the body of the Partsuf. So it depends on the upper part and the rest of the creation, created beings. That's why I wrote there's a medium between the world as a whole and the Creator, and that is the Israeli soul. It's clear, right? Any questions? Yes, Tvika. Oh, you're here. Um, all the time I'm here. Don't you see me? No, without you asking, you're disappearing. But I'm the first to ask today. So what he says is that the, the soul whose root is very high, and that's not clear. Actually, the Rosh is the same part of the Partsuf that doesn't belong to the Partsuf. You have a desire. It's a very simple structure. Very simple. You have Rosh. And you have Toch Sof. Right? And you have Or Makif. The Ma'atzil, the emanator. This is the Rosh. Israel. 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 And here is the nations of the world. So what's not clear? The nations of the world can receive the upper light only when it goes to the Rosh. To the extent the Rosh suits itself to the upper light, this is returning light, this is Oryashar, direct light. And then the Oryashar that's clothed in the returning light, or Pnimi, inner light, penetrates the nations of the world on the condition on the condition that they have a preparation for it. Do you understand what role Israel has? They need to adapt themselves to, as it's called, our Father in the Heavens. They have to suit themselves to the nations of the world. That's one, that's two. They need to receive from the nations of the world their deficiency. That's number three and to raise that deficiency to the Creator is four, and then to get that back from Him, that's five, and all of that is done by the Rosh. So without the Rosh, there is nothing. That's why He says that is the, the main part. It's the medium between the world as a whole and the Creator. And its, it's root is very high. It's a godly part from above. What's the difference between a Rosh and the Guf? The Rosh is seemingly the desires of all the Guf, of all the body, but that are already included with the intention in order to bestow, meaning the quality of the Creator. And this, this mix-up, this mix we have in Israel between the two worlds, between the quality of the Creator and the created beings, and, and Israel, they're not leave anything for themselves. They only have the, the third middle part of Tiferet. So we see that this nation is unique and that it's horrible before its correction.